Yes, I know you can hear my AC in the background. I'm sorry about that, but it's hot as I hell can't. out here. And if one day I get big enough to where I just can live alone and deal with all that, then you guys won't ever have to hear that. Because I will turn the AC up to fucking freezing every day. Okay, so anyway. A friend showed me this series and said I should react to it. Apparently it's not very... Never mind, it's a lot bigger than I thought. But the career hasn't gotten a lot of... Well, how should I put this? I think they should probably get more support. And I feel like we're supporting them just a little by watching this. So, let's give it a go, shall we? Let's the, go! The Earth Guy, Episode 1. Animated Pilot. Because a lot of people don't know about this, but I do one day want to make an animation myself. That noise. <laughs> ah! We're in Monsters, Inc. Impossible. A CD from... You haven't been Mike Wazowski yet. From... It's from Earth. Earth. For the world as we know it. Okay. After fighting many battles, I finally obtained it. The animation's pretty good here. Waits. Fortune oh. or doom. I didn't know you were in the show. Yes. <laughs> We've obtained new lands, that... settlers. The alien nation is taking over. I, I I I got nothing I can say about this. <laughs> there is nothing I can say to defend myself <laughs> from that. Uh, from this accusation. accusation. <laughs> I mean, I am also one of those people who likes playing strategy games deep into the night, just doing, okay, just one more turn, just one more turn. You I know. That was books. Just, just one more. One more uh, issue up there. Sure, takes uh, 15 minutes to read and it's 12.30. I used to do that with uh, reading, where I actually had a reading problem where I would read late into the night and just wake up haggardly. I had a reading problem so bad that well, the school beat it out of me. Oh, that's um, wow. Metaphorically. Oh. I wasn't allowed to check out books in the library. There was a funny thing where a teacher stopped me in class because I preferred to to uh, basically read on my phone, and she looked like like what are you doing? And I told her uh, I'm just waiting for my next class so she's like well it's our time it's not your time and she basically just did it to be an ass like quite clearly yeah i noticed a lot of teachers tend to be on power trips yeah anyway moving on oh i yes, think you took I'm the disc out ah oh. imagine having a train that packed a bus do you mean or just a train. Oh, that, the body took a train, then a bus. It, it took a bus, as far as I can tell. Alright, people! You have one day left to submit your entry for the space-time capsule. Oh! Remember, this is a very unique opportunity for our school. I'm sorry, my mind just went to the best possible answer to this sort of thing. What? If there is intelligent life out there, we oh. might as well teach him how to do it. Oh my god, we're not going GX Please again. Take it seriously. Please take it seriously. You know they won't. They're kids. Hey man. Did god, you get no. something? Uh, yeah. We're gonna try oh, and send the aliens a meme. The issue is... What is this? It's a stream. They lack the necessary cultural context to understand the inherent absurdism of said meme. What did he say? Now oh, that's he stream. Seriously? You think this oh, no. violent garbage is worthy to be violent in garbage? As any of that oh no! Oh. First off, this is art. Oh, it she draws Yowie, <laughs> and it makes and then the Yowie. Like no, you, you send the aliens a, a video game. They send him a stream of a video game. Uh. And she wants to send Yow. <laughs> or maybe she doesn't, but the. Like, that's clearly supposed to be like a reference to. Uh, was it High School Host Club? Or on High School Host Club, yeah. Maybe? I don't know, I didn't watch it. I know, I only know it because the designs of characters and the color of their outfits. To express our emotions and culture for thousands of years. 
It's yaoi. You, you, it's not cultured. Don't even try. Unlike your video games. Whatever. <laughs> so, did Space, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> First off, this is art. And art has been created by mankind to express our emotions and culture. For I don't feel like she has a leg to stand on here. She doesn't. That's why he's reciting the exact same Isn't thing she is. said. Yeah. All right, guys. I'm That's why he did that, just to spite her. He did specifically just to spite her. Sad, but I just wanted to check out this launch. Remember when I talked about that space time capsule? Oh, he's a streamer. Streaming in space. Do I believe in aliens? I don't see why not. I mean, there's probably so something out there. We couldn't possibly be alone, the... right? I mean, it is possible we could be alone, and that's kind of terrifying. Oh, black hole. What? And they found it. Goopy little aliens. Oh my god. <laughs> They're just playing around with all the stuff. Oh. Did they set fire to a lot of it? It looked like a diamond store sign, which, yeah, no burn that. Mm. Did you call on his phone? New essay? Oh, goddamn. Usually my my teachers would have essays, but not with a word count, but with a page count. I think... I am of the opinion that... Oh, he's have Because he's trying to stretch out the word count. We've all done that. Yeah. That fuck. Well, they now assume he's rule of the earth, or at the very least, some sort of military conqueror. Yeah. This is gonna be like a Twilight Zone episode, I feel yeah. like. One of the sillier ones, though. Ugh. Maybe. What's making me? Oh shit! It I could have that one episode of Megas where uh, where the S four shows up to kick Coop's ass for being the most evil being they've ever encountered. Yeah. Only you know this guy can't isn't actually a threat to everyone Inserting around him. Auto -translator. Oh! <laughs> Inserting in a translator. Listen, it was so much easier back when you just put your fish. We'll put this fish in your ear. We don't have babble fish. We should. Wait. That is legitimately. Mm. I legitimately love that. Yeah, they just casually. Well, it just got acknowledges it and then casually offers the solution while acknowledging how unlikely the solution is to exist. Yeah. An auto translator would be love. Would be amazing, but. Oh. Are you gonna eat me? What? No. I'm a vegetarian. I can speak for the rest, though. <laughs> anyway, welcome to your new school. I guess. Oh, what the hell? New school? Well, then. <laughs> What's happening? Uh. Oh, those are your fellow students. Did they just try to shoot him? Everyone wants to make a dramatic entrance. A tank? Oh, interesting. What is the swing attached to? I don't know. Probably space nonsense. And from the darkest void. A space dolphin! <laughs> I know that one Spider-Man comic that briefly entered the world of the 60s cartoon. Who let the Insecticons in? I don't trust the way those eyes are, are curved up in joy. Yeah, it's obviously a bug person. 
Listen, I'm just saying, if it comes down to it, my... Uh... Okay, they're trying to go really What's like... What's the difference? Presentation! Yeah. The presentation! A lot of these designs are interesting, and that's a furry in the background. Well, let's go. Wouldn't want to be late. We have so much to discuss. Is he going to become like Galactic Emperor? Something? Welcome to Space School of Rumakun, I guess. This makes me think a little bit of... What was that really good show about a guy joining a school of demons? You're, he gets adopted by a Thanks. demon grandpa. Guy, right? I literally just made a joke uh, about that. Welcome yes. to Demon School of Rumakun. Ah! Attention, I haven't watched please. that in a while. I'm glad me either, but my roommate loves it. About Apparently there's a... Um, a mafia alternate universe manga going alongside it? Huh. The thing I know about is the kid is just so goddamn genuine and good-hearted that they j everyone Entrance just comes to love him. With helium, uranium, Pretty much. And because Meanwhile, he's, mafia, Ruma, what a he's genuine. He's kind-hearted. Anyway. Okay. He also uh, uh, well, understands the need to give some people concrete shoes every now and then. Okay, well, let's see what we're going to do here. I Third kind of want to hear what they're doing. Years. Good to have you back. Oh. And congratulations to our new students. How do you get in? I'm sure I don't need to tell you what an honor it is to be accepted into our prestigious... What? Zerg? I was about to guess Zim. You're late. Being fashionably late is a proud tradition on Kathoa. Oh, <laughs> The bold. The brave. The beautiful. Kafua sucks. <laughs> is punished by death. <laughs> oh, those darn kids. Sit down, Miss Von Scree. <laughs> now, where were we? Put all your death ray away. Our prestigious school. Right. I got a video to explain all that. This is pretty good so far. To the intergalactic university it is. Of voice acting is a bit system. of work. Well, I mean, I will say when you're trying to get voice actors, the voice quality can differ depending on what type of mic. And you, as someone that actually has done, like, comic animation and knows how voice actors can differ, I kind of know a bit about this. Reminds me. I need to... I've been trying to get it some voice acting gigs, literally anything, but sadly no one's gotten back to me. Uh, if if someone I know doesn't come through, I'll talk to you. But yeah. Okay, let's see what this is. I guess if you've been living under a rock or on a rock, you <laughs> might be wondering what is I guess. Well, <laughs> I guess it's the school oh, for you. Fucking trend. Here we teach you the fundamentals of being a grant leader. Yeah. Defend your borders. Defeat oh. your enemies. Make your parents proud by getting that pristine certificate. Our students give us a 10 out of 10. Never change. <sighs> Let me go back to that. Pristine certificate. Oh, basically... Our students give us a 10 out of 10. Never change, I guess. So basically, quite literally, this is a school for the most gifted and most, like, possible great people at, with next coming. Why, uh, yes, you silly. How else are you Looks going like to become that... part of the intergalactic community without a diploma? Without a diploma. You're all alone in the scary universe. Defenses against inevitable You'll have to work at Space McDonald's. Doom. Oh, so he might need to do that. that. Do you? No, I don't. Then get studying, lazy. Be smart. I imagine work his penchant for risk-taking and, uh... General, and the fact that he got here by playing a tactics game is probably going to help him. That and the very real, well, and the fact that he is very aware Trish. of how easily something could happen to him. Yeah. No drugs. No Bye -bye. drugs. <laughs> Don't cry. No. No. Now you may have heard this before. Oh, no, but... no, this can't be real. Is Earth in danger? Alone and defenseless? Unless I get us a certificate? There's no oh. other option. I gotta do this. I Earth. mean, I understand. You're still left with, uh, even if you get but, a certificate. But they'll never pass. I no, mean, you will could pass make a way. You have to. Of, 
a way Just back. Quietly make your way through school and draw no attention to yourself. Maybe you'll have a chance. And this year, we have a student from a planet we didn't even know exists. Oh, allow me to in introduce Mr. Neil Wang. His name is Wang? Huh. Whenever I hear the name Wang, I mainly think of Dragon exception. Shadow Dragon. Oh. It's over for the world as we know it. Oh. Hey, that's your bid. No way. Oh, this is my favorite part. Wait, right, they all watched it? <laughs> my favorite part is when he ends the stream and it all turns dark. Really that's kind of horrifying. And now, funny montage. I oh. found a dog. I found a dog. You are gonna be armies. <laughs> oh, look at this cute God, little hat. Honestly, we'd all probably do that if we could have our dogs lead the armies in RTSs or games like this. We would. Uh, I know there's at least one RTS style game where. Uh, in a reference to Caligula, you can appoint a horse to, uh, <laughs> to your, uh, to your governing body. Follow me, peasants! And should you put things right, it is possible for that this horse... This has been Neil from Earth. To space. To, uh, I guess. This is the dedication I want. Oh. This is inspiration, students. Oh no, they're gonna be gunning for him now. As soon as people think you're a teacher's pet, they are going to screw you over. Dude, what an entrance! Absolute madman. I'm Zav, by the way. Zav, hey. that's I like his design. I'm Ed. He has best friend. Hey. And you're Neil from Earth. Yes, I, I am. am. She's giving me the weird friend. Away. A weird right friend, before but. the edge of the universe, which marks the end of all existence. Oh, wonderful. Uh, she, I think she means we're, since we're on one of the spiral arms. And for which there is nothing but the deep darkness of gold space. That's where you I mean, the universe does have an edge. Right. So then you've Enough. never heard of Kathoa. No. Oh, that's her biggest problem. Where do you keep pulling those from? Oh, sorry. Your minus? Aquello Elric Fontana. Oh, he has a really I'm good mic. Neil. Space Elf! <laughs> Space Elf, please. <laughs> oh my god, he's an Eldar! Yes, it's a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, you too, mermaid, but Is it just me, or is it hot here? Nah, it's just me. <laughs> Big Neil Solo. Neil. Can he Can touch his hand? without burning? Mm hmm. Mm. <laughs> Not even he knew. The bug people don't like him. Look who's quite the attention gatherer. New guy. Not just new guy. He's extra new guy. What does that new, mean? New? Yes, we get it. What does that mean? I hope this isn't too intimidating for you. Especially the new ones tend to break under the what pressure of high expectations. What does her design remind me of? Mm, I don't know. Not owl but house, not you, but... right? Oh, sh the weird Shira remake. Oh no. Winks Club. Yeah. Oh, we'll I can see do. it. <laughs> she, she she keeps like of having course. her hair flip, so yeah. I'm cool. Honestly, can I still leave and pretend nothing's happened? Feels... <laughs> Funny guy. This is forever. <laughs> Three years actually. Well, shit. I can tell you're gonna love Ed. I enjoy random interjections of horror. I hope to one day make an animation that's at least this good. Like, like, it needs work. That uh, said, it's still very good. Solid. I, I, I feel like watches. I feel like they're shipping him with the space uh, mermaid merman, but I'm not sure. I'm alive. There was a lot of. But I'm not sure. I'm not good at finding at seeing these things. But yeah, if I don't think the author is gonna watch this, but if you are, you did a wonderful job as someone who's also we trying to create his own. Yes, we do. 
And as someone that's trying to create his own stuff, I hope you are st continue to be able to create this stuff. Because, honestly, I love independent animation, especially on YouTube. Also, reach out if you need a deep voice. It's well, already well. I mean, we both have deep voices, but anyway. Indeed. Uh, now you just feel like you're going, oh, oh. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to leave the link down here in the description for this, like I do with all my videos, but I especially want you guys to check out this one to help the creator, because... I honestly believe they deserve it. Because I like the story where this is going. It's very silly. It's very, you know, high school comedy. But, you know, that works sometimes. It got legitimate laughs out of me. Yeah. Which, uh, I'll admit, is kind of hard to do sometimes for Matt. So, thank you all so much. And we'll see you later. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to. And I'll be back. See you around.